Greetings, I'm Barney Malekian, Police Chief for the City of Santa Barbara. And today I want to talk to you about the challenges of recruiting new police officers and retaining the ones that we have. The environment that we have been working and living in as a society for the last almost two years have presented some truly unique challenges. COVID has reduced the amount of face-to-face -face contact that our officers have with people. They have compelled people to make lifestyle choices and review what's important to them. We've gone to great lengths internally to, uh, to maximize the wellness and well-being of the people who work here and to make it clear that their work is valued and their work is important. The bigger challenge is, is recruitment, is that pool of new people who are the next generation of law enforcement and making sure that we have adequate numbers of qualified people and that we do not lower the high standards that we have maintained for, for years and years and years. Uh, to that end, uh, we, have, we have broadened our outreach as you're going to see. We've gone to some, some places that traditionally we haven't before. We've traveled, uh, we, we've traveled to military bases, we've traveled to college campuses, and we've done a number of things to try to bring our message uh, to people who might recognize uh, that this is a career of some value. We also, for those people who work for the city of Santa Barbara, have implemented a, a, a recruitment bonus, 50% uh, upon uh, when the person is, is hired, and another 50% when they complete their probationary period and that recruitment bonus is $3,000. To that end, and you're gonna see, a, you're gonna meet a lot of, of, of people uh, in this video who are going to show you some of the different things that we've done, and I hope you find it of value. My name is Sergeant Ben Ahrens, and I'm with the Santa Barbara Police Department. I'm one of two training, hiring, and recruitment sergeants here at the police department. And what I'd like to talk to you today is about the hiring process for entry-level police officers, lateral police officers, and dispatchers here at the Santa Barbara Police Department. And we're starting with the process of the entry-level police officers. It all begins with the application process. So one thing that we look to is the personal history statements and the application. Upon review, you'll be invited to a written test, which is a written exam. There's study guides that are located throughout the website. and. Once you submit the application and go through, uh, you'll be invited to the interview process once passing the written exam. It's a very extensive process. Uh, the Santa Barbara Police Department has changed its steps uh, to expedite and try and get the applications pushed through and the backgrounds accomplished between three and four months. Uh, our academies are twice a year and we go through the Ventura County Criminal Justice Training Center located in Camarillo, California. The dispatch positions, we have several vacancies. And that's also an extensive testing process and application process, which involves an online practice test, which must be passed in order to continue through the interviews. One thing that we're actively doing to recruit here at the Santa Barbara Police Department is visiting local colleges, uh, community colleges, and also actively recruiting at military bases, also through social media. Our website, www.joinsantabarbarapd.org, uh, has all the information and list of positions that are open, as well as the ability to submit an application online through the Government Jobs website. One thing that you'll find on the website is the physical testing videos, which demonstrate the physical agility testing for entry-level officers. Uh, those demonstrations and the requirements for passing uh, can be found on the website. The Santa Barbara Police Department doesn't require uh, an education requirement other than a high school diploma or a GED. However, it is recommended to have some college and associates or bachelor's degree uh, for different positions here at the police department. We're also currently hiring four to six police cadets. The police cadet is an entry level position here at the police department and allows you to gain an experience, develop relationships within the police department and experience responsibilities and duties that officers and other administrative staff do here at the police department and uh, whether it be assisting at the police range, at the firing range, uh, assisting in the records department, uh, maintaining fleet vehicles, and also uh, assisting with equipment and issuing of different type of equipment here at the police department. Um, I chose the Santa Barbara Police Department because I was born and raised in Santa Barbara. I went to all local schools, uh, Santa Barbara Community Academy, La Colina, San Marcos High School, Santa Barbara City College, 
and I just wanted to give back to my community where I was raised. So when I went to high school, we had a school resource deputy. A lot of people didn't like to communicate with them or really make contact, and a lot of people saw police officers as something negative, and I thought, why not be with somebody who can change that perspective among my age group and even younger people who think that, you know, they're not here to help us. On the opposite, they're here to hurt us, when in reality, that's not what we're here for. I wanted to become a police officer uh, because I think it's a really unique blend um, of just stuff that I'm passionate about, stuff that I love doing, helping community members, um, protecting people, while also getting to do really exciting things that you wouldn't get to do normally, like driving the units, um, working with partners. All of those things kind of combined uh, to make me really excited about doing the job. I picked the Santa Barbara Police Department because during my hiring process I had the opportunity to meet uh, several of the officers who work here and I was just struck by how uh, personable they were, how genuine, uh, how much they really cared about getting to know me and how much they obviously cared about working in the community and uh, about the people they served and that really stuck with me and stood out to me um, and I thought to myself I want to be a part of that work culture I want to be a part of that environment where everyone feels supported and is coming alongside each other uh, to make a positive change in the community. I hope you have found the last few minutes to be informative and to have conveyed the fact that this profession is, is worthwhile and would be a great career. And if you know someone who you think would be a good police officer, who would meet the standards that you would want to have somebody to come to your house, then please encourage them to come down and apply. I could give you a long list of reasons based on 50 years of experience about why this is a wonderful career and why uh, all the good things that there are about it. But maybe I could just leave you with this. If I was 50 years younger, but I knew everything that was going to happen to me over the course of the next 50 years, I would do this again in a heartbeat without hesitation. It is worthwhile and it is meaningful and I am grateful to have gotten to spend my adult life doing something I love. And I hope that those of you who are watching will consider joining the Santa Barbara Police family. Thanks.